Hello everyone, this is Lamin Sani of LS Web Apps. In this video, we're going to be reading a folder uh, or directory, if you want to call it that, and list the files in there. Okay, so um, the first thing we need to do is um, make sure that we have some a directory and some files in it. So I've got a head um, up front and do, done that. So in our um, base htdocs folder, I have a folder called some folder and two files in it, some file one and then two. Okay. So first we need to create a resource um, to open the file. So let's just store that in a variable called resource and um, use the function open dir, okay? And um, in there you pass in the um, name of the directory that you want to have a resource for. In this case, some um, folder. Okay, so next what you need to do is um, create some sort of entry reading so there's this function called read directory in PHP so we're going to read the directory and um, store that inside a variable so we say read dir and then you pass in the resource that you want to read so basically what this is doing is anytime you call the read directory um, function it returns to you the next file in the directory so basically if you want to read all the files you have to keep um, calling this function until it um, returns false for you basically it's telling you that um, no more files exist in the directory and an easy way to do that is keep looping over and calling that so we say while entry equal to uh, this is not equal to equal to false so what are we saying here if you remember I said a few seconds back that um, this returns false if it cannot find the file if there is no longer any files or it's, it can't read the uh, next file So as long as it is reading the next file, we want to keep looping and um, let's echo that entry And uh, let's put a break point break um, tag just right after reading the file so that they're on their same line online So we refresh as you can see we have all those files um, text 1 and text 2 Okay, so let's look in the browser and inspect these files. This is okay, um, this file and this one here. But um, you may notice that we have the dot and the um, double dots. So basically what that is, is uh, these are hidden files inside this folder here. They are just um, a way of telling the whichever, whoever's reading the current folder that um, this signifies the current folder up of that folder. So when we're here and you do a dot dot in your terminal, that will take you um, one um, folder up from there and this one is just the current folder, okay? So to make sure that those do not appear in the reading, you can do an if check here, say if entry is not equal to um, dot and entry um, it's not equal to dot dot okay then we want to echo that okay so um, let's go back here refresh as you can see both those are gone okay so um that's how you read a directory and list the name of the files in there okay so thanks for watching i will see you soon in another video cheers bye bye